if Harvey hits hard enough, a loss of power <clears throat> is definitely a possibility. Local generator distributors say they've already seen a large increase in sales thanks to the storm. Janelle Baluda has more on what you need to know if you're shopping for wine. Hey guys, well with the uncertainty heading into this week and we want to make sure you know everything you need to know about power supply should we lose electricity. Now I've got Justin here. He's a project manager with Generator Supercenter. Now Justin, tell me about our options. What is this guy right here? This is what you would consider your portable generator solution. Um, it runs on gasoline and will power some essential circuits inside of the house like a refrigerator, a couple of lights, it won't power the whole home, right? Exactly. Very, very minimal power to the house. It's a, enough for a couple lights, ceiling fan, um, and the TV. And if you want to power your whole home, though, you've got the bigger guy right here. Ex What's this? Exactly. This is what we would consider a 22KW standby generator. Um, what a standby generator is, is it essentially auto detects a power outage, auto starts, auto transfers and powers the house. And it's run on natural gas. Exactly. And that, you were saying earlier, is that it's never cut off even during an outage. That's right. Continuous fuel supply. Um, you're not dealing with gas stations, long lines or anything along that. Okay. This guy runs on gas. So you mm -hmm. always have to have gas around, Correct. right? And then you have to manually start it. Correct. But it, and it only powers, um, you know, your necessities, a refrigerator, a few lights. If you just need a, a small source of power, you can find this guy at Home Depot and Lowe's. But Justin says that they sell the bigger one here. Now this one's gonna, it's gonna cost a little bit more. It's this one's going to be about fourteen thousand. Yeah, roughly fourteen thousand eight hundred is what we're running our our, our special. Um, that's going to include a turnkey install, permits, electrician, plumbers automatic transfer switch, as well as a temporary install um, that we will respond to within the next 24 to 48 hours to get you by through this storm. People can have that by Friday. Okay, great. Correct. And then this one is going to be about $1,000, and that one you can find at Lowe's or Home Depot. Now, we will have all of this information, including this uh, the Super Center's contact info on our website at khou.com. Back to you guys. It's very good advice. Hopefully you won't have to use a generator. Be sure to check the KHU 11 mobile app anytime for updates on the weather conditions. We'll also have details about how to prepare on KHOU.com, on Twitter, and on Facebook.